Hello guys, Minecraft Dynasty here, and I am here to show you how to make a TechIt server. So you're going to want to take TechIt and Google, click Technic Pack, and then we'll load, and then you're going to want to go down here and download this. I'll put everything in the description. Okay, so after that, after it's downloaded, you want to go here, unzip this, Delete these two. Okay, and then you can go into here and type in text edit. Since I already have it here, I can just click it here. And then you're going to want to go into this website, which I will provide in the description. And we'll want to copy and paste this into your, this is not text edit, into your text edit. Command S, save. Plain text, start dot command, save. And then you're going to want to go back in there, which I forgot to do. And then, so right here, this is very crucial. You're going to want to change this to two or how many ever gigabytes you want to actually hold or run the server with. Gigabytes of RAM, command S, save, command Q, quit. And you want to drag this in here. And open up terminal. Want to do chmod a plus x space. chmod space a plus x space. So I will just wait here for you guys. Pause the video here so you guys can catch up if you need to. Okay. Yeah. Now you drag this in here. You click enter. That should work. And then you're gonna want to go into your mods folder. And delete. Uh, where is it? Where is it? Nether ores. That is very important because of Java 7 incompatibilities. And once that's done, you can double click this. Hopefully it'll work. Yep. <laughs> and once that's worked, you're gonna want to go to Bucket Forge and download the latest or recommended version for your Minecraft version. You can, this is very optional, but I recommend it because it's basically adding plugins to your server. So for Forge Essentials, it's like Essentials, but for Forge, Bucket Forge. So you drag Bucket Forge into your mods folder, restart your server, it will generate a plugins folder, I believe, and then you're going to drag whatever's in here from Forge Essentials into your plugins folder. And once that's done, it should be done. Yeah. So I'm going to close all of these. Let's you look at my glorious desktop that changes every 15 minutes. Then we'll go into here. Hopefully it's loaded. Nope, it's still loading things. So we'll just sit here and load. You can skip this, I think. Maybe, but you know. Okay, so. Father Forest, X. Let's see. Also, one thing it says here to delete advanced machines but I don't seem to be able to find that once so advanced machines I see nothing in the A's so I didn't really understand if it was there or not so I just took out that and that should well this should work um yeah it's done refresh and Welcome to TechIt, guys. Hold on, load. Load. Logging in. Aha, it works. As you can see, let us op ourselves. Which means to make us operator so we can use any commands we want. So game of one. Go here. Make this bigger. Wait, actually, yeah, we'll just do that. And so as you can see, we have everything, and mo even modular power suits, which is probably my favorite thing, maybe. I don't know, really. So, just take that, put it on. Just play armor leggings. That, yeah, and there you have it, guys. Take it. Or match. 
Well, there you go. And <laughs> finish, well, I'm in creative. Just finish pig. Yeah. I brought pork chops now. Um, dude, this is too quick. Oh yeah, for Miscraft. Nether horse. See guys, this does not work. See? Internal server error. That means that it, it, the server is not recognizing that ID, and it's like, what are you doing? And it's kicking you off the server for doing something illegal, technically, to it. So, well that's all wrapped up. You got that tutorial in about six minutes. It's pretty fast. It's fast, easy. Updated, short, no. So guys, share this link, like, favorite, subscribe, maybe. And thank you. And yeah, that's pretty much it. Thank you guys, Minecraft Dynasty here and out.